the Midbar, Numbers 28. And Yahuwah spoke unto Moshe, saying, Command at the children of Yasharel, and say unto them, Et my offering and my bread for my sacrifices made by fire, for a sweet savor unto me, shall ye guard to offer unto me in their appointed time. And you shall say unto them, This is the offering made by fire which ye shall offer unto Yahuwah, two lambs of the first year without spot, day by day, for a continual burnt offering. At the one lamb shall you offer in the morning, and at the other lamb shall you offer at evening, and a tenth part of an ephah of flour for a meat offering, mingled with the fourth part of a hin of beaten oil. It is a continual burnt offering, which was ordained in Mount Sinai for a sweet savor, a sacrifice made by fire unto Yahuwah. And the drink offering thereof shall be the fourth part of a hin for the one lamb. In the holy place shall you cause the strong wine to be poured unto Yahuwah for a drink offering. And at the other lamb shall you offer at evening as the meat offering of the morning. And as the drink offering thereof, you shall offer it a sacrifice made by fire of a sweet savor unto Yahuwah. And on the Shabbat, two lambs of the first year without spot, and two-tenth deals of flour for a meat offering mingled with oil and the drink offering thereof. This is the burnt offering of every Shabbat beside the continual burnt offering and his drink offering. And in the beginnings of your months, Ye shall offer a burnt offering unto Yahuwah, two young bullocks and one ram, seven lambs of the first year without spot, and three-tenth deals of flour for a meat offering mingled with oil for one bullock, and two-tenth deals of flour for a meat offering mingled with oil for one ram, and a several tenth deal of flour mingled with oil for a meat offering unto one lamb, for a burnt offering of a sweet savor, a sacrifice made by fire unto Yahuwah. And their drink offerings shall be half a hin of wine unto a bullock, and the third part of a hin unto a ram, and a fourth part of a hin unto a lamb. This is the burnt offering of every month throughout the months of the year. And one kid of the goats for a sin offering unto Yahuwah shall be offered beside the continual burnt offering and his drink offering. And in the fourteenth day of the first month is the Pikach of Yahuwah. And in the fifteenth day of this month is the feast. Seven days shall matzah be eaten. In the first day shall be a holy assembly. Ye shall do no manner of servile work therein. But ye shall offer a sacrifice made by fire for a burnt offering unto Yahuwah. Two young bullocks and one ram and seven lambs of the first year. They shall be unto you without blemish, and their meat offering shall be of flour mingled with oil. Three-tenth deals 
shall ye offer for a bullock, and two tenth deals for a ram. A several tenth deal shall you offer for every lamb throughout the seven lambs, and one goat for a sin offering to make an atonement for you. Ye shall offer these beside the burnt offering in the morning, which is for a continual at burnt offering. After this manner, ye shall offer daily throughout the seven days the meat of the sacrifice made by fire of a sweet savor unto Yahuwah. It shall be offered beside the continual burnt offering and his drink offering. And on the seventh day ye shall have a holy assembly. Ye shall do no servile work. Also, in the day of the first fruits, when ye bring a new meat offering unto Yahuwah, after your weeks be out, ye shall have a holy assembly. Ye shall do no servile work but ye shall offer the burnt offering for a sweet savor unto Yahuwah. Two young bullocks, one ram, seven lambs of the first year, and their meat offering of flour mingled with oil, three-tenth deals unto one bullock, Two tenth deals unto one ram, a several tenth deal unto one lamb throughout the seven lambs, and one kid of the goats to make an atonement for you. Ye shall offer them beside the continual burnt offering and his meat offering. They shall be unto you without blemish, and their drink offerings.